For the last 10 years, pupils at Herbert Morrison Primary School in Lambeth have been taught with the help of a unique assertive discipline system. It's based on consistency across the school, accentuating the positive over the negative and reinforcing the positive message at all times. Staff find that the approach makes it easier to deal with bad behaviour when it occurs. Head teacher Eileen Ross has refined the system in the seven years she's been at the school. And when I first came here, the assertive discipline policy that had been introduced into the borough of Lambeth was actually being applied in this school. But having gained the experience of working in lots of different schools, I changed the, the policy and I modified it to make it more user-friendly, to make it easy for the children to understand and easy for the staff to implement. It never ceases to amaze me, the talents that we have in our school. Baudet and Monique for working well as part of a team. The system is reinforced every week during an assembly in which pupils receive certificates for behaviour as well as achievement. Uh, this is for much improved behaviour in class. Well done. Brandy, for excellent listening skills. And this is for everyone in Elephants for excellent behaviour during their trip to the Tate Modern. Well done, Elephant. The policy is based on a system of sad and happy faces. Good or bad behaviour earns ticks on the happy or sad side of the board. As the ticks add up, they lead to rewards or punishments. Today, if you look in the folders on your desks, you will find some sheets that you're going to use now in literacy. Tessa Cliff is teaching year three. OK, by the count of three, everybody listening. One, well done, Imran and Amador. Two. Three. Good boy, Imran. Excellent. If children are behaving well, other children need to copy that behaviour, so they're, mo they're modelling it. So if you're saying, I like the way that you're sitting and working, or you've made a very big effort there, trying to concentrate very hard, the other children will look at that child and copy that child. If you're saying generally, oh, you're all marvellous because you've walked in here so quietly, no, it, it's, it's too general. When you specifically include the children, they feel special. And then, if you've had to say, uh, I, I need you to sit quietly and do your work, then if you've previously said, you're sitting nicely, that child has got somebody to model, somebody to copy, somebody to look at, and some kind of behaviour to aim, aim for. Well, now then, there's a lot of chatting. Let's see who's waiting quietly. Jamie is. Imran is with their hand up. Good. It's the way that you deliver it. So it's positive, positive, and then you're pulling somebody up. Positive, positive. So I like the way you're doing this. You're sitting very nicely. I need you to sit and listen. And then if it doesn't happen, there's a tick or a name on the board. But it's positive, positive. I need you to do this. Positive, positive. Will you sit and listen? Positive, positive, you need to stop talking and concentrate on your work. Our first instruction is put the water in the kettle and then part of that same instruction is what do we need to do to the kettle, Abdullah? Put the heat on. And turn, turn the on. kettle on. Yeah. First. Right, sharpening pencils needs to be finished by the count of three. One, yeah. because we're wasting time. Two. Two and a half. Three. Well done. I tell you what, yellow group, you're going to get ticked by your names because you're working so hard. You haven't even looked up yet. Keep going. 
Right. So it's much better than stop doing that. I've told everybody not to talk. Stop talking. Oh, that is just a wild phrase aimed at anybody who's talking. I uh, tell you what, Megan, you're trying really hard to write this instruction, and we keep getting interrupted. It's not really fair, is it? No, but I'm in so, the The next person who interrupts me, or someone who's speaking, will have to have their name on the sad side because it's not fair. Okay? okay? Wow! Look at yellow group and at red group. They're all working. They're all working very quietly. Sabrina. Eliza, Priscilla, Tawonga, are you here yet, Tawonga? You are now. Amador, you need a star. Well done, Amador. What's that for? He got three ticks on the happy side. So for three ticks, you get to wear a star. Well, what have you done? Have you? Come along in then. Come right in. And for four, you get to see the head. Four ticks on the happy side. And what did you get your four ticks for? I can't remember. You can't remember? How do we spell your name? C O R A L. C O R A A L. Do you know why I ask you how to spell your name? Because I think it's awful if you get a certificate with your name spelt wrong. Four ticks on the happy side. Well done, Cor. That's three you've had this year, this school year from September. Well done. And Brandy has three as well. Well done. Mummy will be pleased, won't she? Thank you. Bless her. I normally get uh, happy side ones, I'd say between eight and ten a week. And I like to keep them in a drawer because it's a little ritual that the head teacher goes to the drawer, pulls them out of her special file. sitting nicely and that means that your whole table can't go out. Blue table can go out. As soon as I was qualified I came to work here with this policy and um, it's very easy to use but it's also very easy to forget to be positive and pick up on the good things as well. You have to, it become, you have to make it a habit to look for the good things rather than pick up on the things that people aren't doing correctly all the time. But it's very easy once you do that, and they, um, they really respond so well to it that it's worth you. The days that don't go so well, you'll probably find there's less people on the happy side of the board because you've not focused on the good behavior. And when you arrived here as, as an NQT, how long did it take you to get into that habit? Probably a term, or half a term, and then I felt really comfortable with it by the end of the first term, yeah. If sad and happy faces aren't sufficient, class teachers are encouraged to try additional strategies. Let's start with an empty number line. Draw an empty number line. In year four, Jill Robinson has a particularly challenging class. They're a very young class, actually. They're a lot of summer-born children, which means that they, they're having to follow the national curriculum and they're not quite ready for the objectives and the targets that are actually there. There's a lot of boys in here as well. The literacy quite often is a problem for them, but it's actually quite difficult to get them to focus on sitting and writing. There's a lot of different personalities because um, there's an issue about leadership, you know, who the, the children look up to, and who, who they perceive to be the leaders and wanting to um, copy them, really. As a temporary measure, Jill's changed the classroom layout so that everyone's facing the front. This has been a very difficult class. They've gone through the school being quite difficult. And um, what I found is when they worked in a group situation, they couldn't re interact with each other sensibly. So there were lots of arguments and fighting, uh, kicking under the table, just not you know, being aware of each other and certainly not taking care of notice of me. So when I changed the seating, then it meant that they had nowhere else to focus. 
but me. When I first came to this school, and I was sent children who behaved badly or inappropriately. I was getting sent children who burped in class. And I was absolutely amazed that the staff thought that that was so serious that that child needed to be spoken to by the head teacher. And then I realized in the schools that I'd come from before that that was the kind of thing that was ignored. And that's how sloppy and inappropriate behavior creeps in and is allowed to fester. But every tiny little bit of bad manners, every kind of inappropriate behaviour is dealt with seriously because these children have only got one chance in life and they need to know the right and the wrong choices and how to make them. Children are also encouraged to take responsibility for correcting their bad behaviour. Right, young man. How are we going to resolve this? You didn't do as much work as you normally do. What are we going to do? And just because you're behind now, aren't you? So what are you going to do? You've got to catch up before we do the next one next week. What are you going to do? Catch up with Sorry? Catch up with everyone. How? Well, how are you going to do it? Can you ask the children outside to shut the door for me, please? Can you wait one minute? Let me just talk with it. You are supposed to be outside. Yeah, but uh, what, that's not going to help me now. I need you to finish that work, don't I? And when are you going to do it? Now. You're going to do it right now? Go ahead and start, please. Children with sad tics miss an increasing amount of time off break. Four sad tics means a trip to the head. Right, young lady, you've had your five minutes. I hope I don't see your name on the sad side today. Okay, off you go. Sad that Reese is in here now because he's normally very quick, aren't you? And Reese got four stars on the good side yesterday, didn't you? And a special certificate, didn't you? Good boy, Reese, off you go. 2,234 is linked to which one? Pupils who complete their work and behave well receive the ultimate reward. They get to decide how to spend the last five minutes of the lesson. And in Tessa's class, it's quick draw with a difference. Right, let's have two cowboys. Howdy, partner. This is how they be the two of us. Seven tens. Seventy! At Herbert Morrison, they adapt assertive discipline to their own needs. They suggest concentrate on the positive, not the negative, and keep doing it. Be consistent across the school, and don't be afraid to adapt in the short term to particular circumstances. For more information on the Herbert Morrison policy, log on to our website and click on Challenging Children. <laughs>